One year after representatives from Taiwan and China signed a trade and services pact, opponents of the agreement will hold a rally on Saturday. They will demand stronger oversight of the trade pact, the free economic pilot zone project, and other initiatives pending in the legislature. More than two months after the Sunflower Movement's occupation of the legislature ended, Another demonstration is set to take place at the lawmaking body. On June 21st, an evening rally will be held to show that one year after the fateful signing of the Trade and Services Pact, the people have not forgotten. Our first objective will be to show the road we have walked over the past year. We want to show what opponents of the Trade and Services Pact have encountered. Organizers had a message for lawmakers currently holding an extraordinary legislative session. We students and fellow citizens will continue to closely monitor developments that take place during this extraordinary session. When the need arises, we will do everything in our power to stop the Ma administration from unilateral action that ignores the will of others. Also in attendance at the press conference was Tsai Ding-Gui, convener of the Alliance for Referendum for Taiwan. He vowed that older demonstrators would take legal responsibility for what happens during and after the rally.